I'll be showing you step by step how to add an FAQ page to your Shopify store. We'll be doing so using a completely free app as well, making the process super simple. So the app we'll be using is called Avada. It's a WhatsApp chat and FAQ page, and it is completely free here. I'll leave a link for this in the description below. You can also just search Avada in the Shopify app store and find it as well. So once you're on the app page here, let's click install and let's go and set up our FAQ page. And then we'll add it to our Shopify navigation, making it super easy for customers to find it. So after I click the install button, if you're comfortable with the permissions, I'm going to click install app here. From there, I want to enable the app. So I'm going to click enable app at the top here. This is going to open up my Shopify theme editor. It's going to open up the app embeds automatically, checking the Avada app off. If I click save in the top right, this is going to finalize it and make sure it is live on my store. So let's open it up in a new tab. Let's navigate back to my old tab here. And on the left-hand side, we wanna to navigate to the FAQs. So if we navigate to FAQs here, we can see some default FAQs created automatically. And overall, there are categories and under each category, there are specific questions. We can easily toggle these off to make them not featured. We can also edit them by clicking the pencil icon. And for each of these, we can go in and edit the category, the question, and the answer here. So doing this is just gonna make the process easier for customers. So rather than having to contact you, they can easily find their answers on your site. We can also add new categories by clicking add category in the top right here. So next, let's go and manage the FAQ page itself. So clicking on FAQ page, we get several options for the setup process. First, we can choose the preset. We want a dark theme, a light theme, or basic with blue. I'm gonna leave it as the light theme as that matches my current theme on my Shopify store. Next for the header, we can set the heading. So frequently asked questions is fine with me. The color is okay. The description is also fine. I could also maybe say, send us an email if you don't see what you're looking for. For the FAQ style, again, you can set the heading color, the question text color, the background color, and the answer text color and the answer background color. I'm okay with all these presets here. So let's move on to advanced settings. If I toggle this, this lets us add custom CSS if we want to. Since I don't need to, I'm going to toggle it off. And from there, I can click save to finalize my changes. So next, let's go and publish this to my store. So I'm going to hover over the FAQ page here, toggle it on. And next, I'm going to copy this URL here. And I want to go and add this to my navigation. So on the left-hand side menu, if I click on online store and I go down to navigation, I'm going to add this to my main menu on the top section of my store. So if I click on main menu, I'm going to remove this existing FAQ section. If I click add menu item, I'm going to call this FAQ. And then I'm going to paste that link I just copied there. Then clicking add in the bottom right, and then if I hit save at the top here, that's going to finalize my changes. Next, I wanna preview this in my store. So under online store, I'm gonna hover over the eye icon, clicking on it here, opens up my Shopify store. I can now see the FAQ button has been added. If I click on the FAQ button, this brings me to the Avada FAQ page that I just created. I can search for things. I can select the category. I can also open up each FAQ and get the answers that I'm looking for. An easy way to go and create FAQs is just to go through all your customer service emails, find out what people have been asking, and then just add them all to your FAQ section. This is gonna help reduce the support burden and it gives customers a better way to get their answers. If you've made any sales on Shopify, you know how hard it is to keep track of how much money your store has actually made. That's where Profit Calc comes in, the one-click profit calculator available for your Shopify store. All you have to do is select the date range you're looking for to get real-time calculations, including all your ad spend from Facebook, Google, Snapchat, Bing, Pinterest, and TikTok, as well as many other cost of goods sold options. It's going to give you a ton of different details, analytics, and metrics, so you can make smarter business decisions. You can get a 15-day free trial, so you can test drive everything for yourself. There's a link in the description below. You can also find it in the Shopify App Store by searching Profit Calc and then looking for this logo in the top left. So this concludes the video here on how to add an FAQ page to your Shopify store. We used a completely free app, making the process super simple. If you enjoyed this video, I would love it so much if you smash that like and subscribe button below. If you have any questions, leave a comment. But thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.